Okay, welcome to the Field ID unboxing of the Motorola MC9500. This is an enterprise rugged device that we're really excited about. It's got Wi-Fi, uh, it's also got HSDPA, or better known to most people as 3G connectivity, a 2D imager or barcode scanner, 3 megapixel camera, uh, Bluetooth, and we're really excited about it. So let's take a look at what's inside the box. Okay, so we'll grab, I think this is gonna be the handheld right here. We'll grab that first. It looks like we've got some power cords in there. And there you can see the model number that we have. This also has an 800 megahertz processor, which is gonna make Field ID absolutely scream. At least that's what we're hoping for. So we're doing an evaluation of this device, and if it performs well, we're gonna add it to our list of officially supported devices, okay? So first, uh, first impressions are, it's definitely a little heavy, but that's, that's uh, noticeable and expected of a rugged device. It's got a nice form factor though, fits well in your hand. Um, it's got a strap on the back, there's the camera, and there's the imager up top. Not sure if it's powered up, but um, we'll go ahead and turn it on and see if it is powered up. And I'm not sure if that's the power. If not, we will, um, that's the power right down there. If it's not powered up, what we'll do is we'll plug it in and then we'll fire it up. Okay, so I don't think it has any power. We'll put it aside right now. We'll take a look at what else is in the box. This is probably going to be a docking station. That's the cord for the docking station. And here's the actual docking station itself. So it looks like it just slips right in there. Charges. It does not have room for an extra battery. Sometimes that's what you see with docking stations. This one doesn't. And what else is in the box here? It's like the base and the battery pack. And then it's also got the plug, uh, which is a nice standard. This is what you would use for most of your PCs. Okay, we'll plug it in and we'll fire it up so you can take a look at it uh, turning on for the first time. Okay, so we're back to finish the unboxing. You can see the docking station. What's really neat about the docking station is you can plug in a regular uh, AC adapter, but there's also the ability to plug in um, a micro USB. And you don't slip it into the docking station and lock it traditionally. You just kind of hang it off, which I really like. Just before we put it on the docking station, something I wanted to show that I really liked was um, it looks like there's some sort of a battery indicator on the back here, which is really neat, a uh, quick, easy way to tell um, at what the battery pack is, is, is looking like as far as power goes. Um, a couple other small things, there's also the ability to plug in headphones, uh, you've got your stylus here. Um, it's very thin, that's one thing that we noticed as well. Um, and you've got dedicated triggers on the side for your barcode scanning. So let's go ahead and slip it on the docking station and fire it up for the first time. So it slips in very easily, which is really nice, and it should fire up on its own. We can also press the power button. There we go. So this one is running, uh, it looks to be Windows Mobile 6, uh, but I believe this also comes with Windows Mobile 6.5. Um, so there it is. Brand new Motorola, just dropped off by UPS, and we're gonna put it through the paces and you might see this coming to a field ID deployment soon.